Well, our chances of winning this league and that automatic promotion spot is slim to none. So it's all about securing a playoff spot now. We beat Torquay, we're in the playoffs. Hi folks, I'm welcome to Club One, episode 29 of Half Star to Five Star here on Football Manager 24. I'm Russ Cook, today we have two games for you. Where these two games are, I don't know. All we know is one of them is against Torquay. We beat Torquay, we secure a playoff spot, so then we then jump to the end of the season. If not, we'll play a game until we actually secure those, that well, that playoff spot. So since you guys were last with us, we have been dreadful still. Uh, we lost to Maidenstoke. Maidenstoke? We lost to Maidstone. Uh, we drew with Tunbridge Angels, we beat Weymouth, and then we drew with Dartford in the most recent game. We are now down in third place, 79 points, 14 points behind South End. I don't think we're catching them, I think they've won the league. So yeah, we just need to win and secure one of these six playoff spots. I'm hoping it's going to be second or third. So let's just jump straight into it. We need to beat Torquay, let's go out and smash them. Obviously, we didn't move to Air, um, Leighton Orient or Air Dronians. Air Dronians, they weren't offering us enough money, so we weren't going to jump there. And Leighton Orient did exactly the same as Barnet and said, no, thank you. We don't want you. Moving on from that, team we're putting out there for the Torquay game then is Mayo and Gart, back for Seddon, Ameson, Kanida and Kowachi. All cock at the base midfield, Morton and Griffiths in front of him. Bianchi in the shadow striker role with a bang and Norquette leading the line. Robinson's picked up an injury. He's out for the next two months. He's probably going to miss the, the end of the season. Hopefully we can get him back for those playoffs. If not, it's just going to be a Beng and Palmer Holden that's going to be playing up there with Norquette. Norquette needs to score goals. He's not going to get that target otherwise. And it is the first highlight here. It is Torquay. It's put in towards the back of the box. He hit the crossbar. Mayo's there diving around. I think he's got to go in the summer. I don't think he's good enough to be our goalkeeper. Then again, Mason Terry is just as bad. So we're going to be spending the majority of the summer just probably clearing out this entire squad and bringing in a lot more players, a lot better players. We'll probably go for another formation change as well. In the, uh, the four seasons that we've been here, we played three, four different formations. We just we can't seem to settle on anything. Can't settle on a formation. Can't settle on a tactic. Can't settle on a team. It's just it's it's, it's getting away from us. In it's just season after season where. Western are falling away and we're not getting any closer to, to getting out of getting out of the obscurity that we're in. But we have taken the lead here. It is Morton with a shot from range. He's known for those. Gets us 1-0 up. At the moment, that is playoff secured for us. That put us... How many points did that be? 18 points clear of them with 15 to go. Mayo there clutches the ball nicely. I just want to get a second goal to settle any nerves. And uh, yeah, that allows the team to then play with a little bit of freedom as Mayo launches this long, trying to find Bianchi and can't find him. Torquay then with the ball on the right-hand side. Put a challenge in someone. Put a foot in. Keep him out there. Ah, said and did well to get it then. Cuts in, gives it to Morton, the goal scorer, into Griffiths. Now feeding it up through the centre. Norquette turns. Feeds it to Bianchi. Goes back to Alcott. Touches it to Morton. Alcott for a shot from range. Wasn't far over the bar, but... Needed the little bit more dip to bring it down and, and trouble the goalkeeper or hit the crossbar. Something along those lines. Oh, we've conceded. Oh, it's a known goal. Koachi on the line puts it in. 1-1. One, 1-1. One. One, one. I mean, does 1-1 one, one still secure it for us? I don't think it does. It's 16. Oh, it would do, sorry. 16 with 15 points to play for so yeah even a draw secures it for us here Bianchi feeds it up trying to find a bang a bang isn't a striker he's a, he is a, a, sh a shadow striker an attacking midfielder Torquay doing well to head that back then feed fed it into the box and Mayo dives the wrong way 2-1 this team this save or this portion of the save I love the non-league side of it but this is it's infuriating it really is Oh, it's, yeah, not not good. Half time, two on a talkie. We need to get ourselves back into this. I'm going to throw that ball. They have been terrible. See what happens to that. It stressed them out. Is it stressed them out enough to to get the winner, or have I just completely capitulated the squad in? That this collapse could end up to me getting sacked at the end of this season. It's talkie. Get the ball forward. They're in the box. Ameson does poorly. He's meant to be an amazing defender. 3-1 to Torquay, and it's all our own doing this. It's all our own, it's all our doing. 
if we don't get promoted, I'm going to go on record now and say I'm going to resign. Because it's... What more can we do with this team? We're bringing the players in. We're recycling every year. Getting rid of the, the dead wood. Bringing the new players through. And it's just not working out for us. Make those two changes there. So is Sadi coming on for Bianchi. And Palmer Holden coming on for a bang. We've got... What, 22 minutes left to find three goals? Morton then with the ball. Feeds it over to Seddon. Put it in the box. You're meant to be amazing as well. Uh, I thought the deflection was going to go in there. We do have a corner. We are going to go very attacking. We need to attack this game now. And I'm going to encourage these boys. Said and then with the corner. Kanida's underneath. It has been cleared. Morton picks up the loose ball. Goes to Sadi. Griffiths. Kanida. Give it to someone to shoot. Oh, we, we, we sort of did there. And there's Sadi. But it's another good save from the tall key goalkeeper. We're getting opportunities. We just need to, to put it in the back of the net. We're encouraging now. Seddon puts it in. Too close to the goalkeeper. I can see what Kanida was trying to do then. He's trying to get onto the ball to head it in. It's just not enough. Corner for Torquay. We've got back out to the corner taker. Edge of the box stuff. Oh. <laughs> can the season end now? Torquay 4. Western 1. It's going to sit in silence. I really don't know what to say. I don't know what to do. It's... Yeah, it's just not... Not how I wanted the season to end. Not The season's not gone how I expected it to go either. Narty's going to come on for a set and it left back. It's all... It's all closing in around me. It's all caving in around me. We lose 4-1. Did we secure a playoff though? It looks like we have. We've at least secured a playoff spot. Which is which is one thing. I'm hoping that's what it's going to say here. Yes, yeah, so we've got the playoffs. I'm going to come back for the final day of the season. There's no point of watching all this. Because this is going to be us just falling apart once again. And then we'll, we'll, we'll just see where the chips lie from that. Where we're going to be finishing. I mean, can we even finish second now? We can, but it's, it's a push. Where, where are we going to finish? We're either going to finish third or we're going to finish fifth. Third or fifth. Let's find out. Right, I decided to sack off the final day of the season because we bottled trying to get into that third place. We uh, yeah, we drew a safe end. We beat Eastley. We beat Folkestone. We then lost to East Bombay, which is what? forced us into uh, where we're finishing now. We did beat Hornchurch 2-0 on the final day of the season. We ended up finishing fourth. Now, it would have been a good battle going into the, the final day with Weldstone had we had beaten Eastley or Eastbourne. Yeah, it was Eastbourne. Wasn't to be. We finished fourth. We are now going to be playing well in in the playoffs. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to do the playoffs. We're going to, fingers crossed, get out of this division. I mean, that's all we can do now. Get out of the Vanarama South and just move on. Move on and move up the leagues. Maybe move away from the club as well. If we lose the playoffs, I don't know what to do after that. I really don't. We'll join you for the Welling game. Playoff round one then against Welling. The team we're putting out there is Mayo in goal. A back four, Seddon, Ames and Kanida. And Burt Whistle waters at the base midfield with Nelson and Griffiths in front of him. A Beng in the shadow striker position. Palmer Holden and Norquette are leading the line. Norquette has been on a goal drought. He did score at the end of the season against Hornchurch, but he needs to pick it up now. Needs to be scoring goals. Needs to just, just show us the, the, the sort of striker he is. The sort of striker we know he can be. Win this game. Win the next one. Win the final. That's all we're expecting. That's all we want. It's all we need. We're going to be pushing for it. We've got the ball here. Seddon on this left-hand side. And he's giving it away. The easier pass was to go into the centre, not going backwards. Well in into the box. They have a shot. They flash it over the bar. It wasn't troubling Mayo whatsoever. Poor attempt from Wellin. I don't know if it's in front of their fans as well, down at that, down at that end of the ground. I don't know where the away fans are for Western Stadium. But we've been... We've not been great. We've had two shots, which is just equaled theirs. The XG on both sides is bad. We're going on the attacking. We're also encouraging as well. Just 
fingers crossed this is going to be enough to get us over the line. Even if we win this one 1-0, one we can then pick up the form for the next two. I get that we are coming into this one with 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 bottling everything. We bottled the league. We bottled we bottled the league twice now, haven't we? Or maybe three times. We bottled promotion as well in the playoffs. Seddon puts his corner in. It's Kanida! Ben Kanida hits the crossbar, comes down, goes in the back of the net. 1-0 just before halftime as well. Massive, massive confidence lifter for us. Our fans are jumping around. I've just seen where the Welling fans are. We scored in front of them. Halftime, 1-0. Only the one shot on target throughout the whole game. And it's our goal that is, is, is given us that, that, that lead. That, that, that shot that's put us in a commanding position. Hopefully we can hold on to it from here. We do have some tired legs on the pitch, so we'll give them to like 65 minute mark and then we'll take some players off. Oh, this is just what we need. We need to stay strong here. Well in on the attack in front of their fans. They whip the ball across. Oh, they hit the crossbar. Mayo was scrambling for that one. Just completely misjudged the flight of the ball. Let's make those changes. It is going to be... Seddon's going to be coming off, so Kowachi can come in from it left back. Uh, who else is knackered? Bianchi can come on for a bang. That's the only two we're going to make now. We'll make the final substitution around the 18 minute mark. We need to get clear at another corner here from Wellham. Comes in. Oh, we have got it clear. Soon as far as the man on the edge of the box though. We've let him dance into the box and luckily the shot flashes past the front of the goal. Flashes past the post. Goes out for a goal kick. We're going to drop down to positive. And I'm going to... I'm going to say no pressure to the boys. I don't want them to feel like they need to go up there and get a second goal. As long as we can sit on this lead here and get ourselves into the next round, I'm happy with that. We are going to make the change here on the 86th minute. It's going to be Nguipissi coming on for Ameson at the back. We've got three minutes of normal time plus whatever the ref wants to put on. It's three more minutes. I think we've done enough. We've got a corner here. Koachi puts this one in. It's too close to the goalkeeper, comes out, collects it. He waits for the wedding players to get into position before he launches the attack. And there it goes. We just need a Western head onto this ball. It is. It's Burt Whistle into Griffiths. Feeds it to Norquette, who's got three players around him. Kanida comes across to win the ball. Runs himself. I thought he ran himself back into a coldy sack. Then Burt Whistle clears it, trying to find Palmer holding can. Falls nicely for Nelson, though. Into Kanida, the goal scorer. At the moment, he's the match winner. Burt Whistle then up this right-hand side, feeds it into Norquette. Norquette got two players round him. He was better off just hitting it into the box. A little bit of a hit and hope. Palmer Holden's got the ball. We're into the semi-finals. Palmer Holden read the play, read the pass, nicked it, put it in the back of the net. That's what we want. There's a winner for us. Oh, one down, two to go. That's, yeah, one down, two to go. Let's go for that one. Let's go for the next game. Playoff semi-final time then against Weldstone. The team are putting out there is Mayo in goal. A back four, Seddon and Guipasi, Kanida and Burt Whistle. Waters at the base midfield with Morton and Nelson in front of him. A bang in the shadow striker role. Robinson and Norquette leading the line. Everyone is expecting us to lose this game. I hope we can get across the line here. Weldstone finished above us in the league. They ended up finishing in that third spot where I wanted us to finish. I think we can do it. We are away from home. We just need to be at our absolute best. Absolute best. And, and just score every opportunity we get. Put this in. If it's Kanida, probably could have got a goal. We got it again there. Waters into Burt Whistle. Over to Nguipasi. Turn it onto the right-hand side. Morton through the centre. Launches it to Sed and put across him. He does. It's Norquette. There's one. One nil. Four minutes on the clock. Norquette scoring as well. Oh, that's the start we wanted. That is the absolute start. We didn't want that, though, did we? Oh, level pegging. Back to square one. Back to all square. 1-1. One, one. As soon as we scored, they, they, yeah, they just put it in the back of the net, don't they? Put it in the back of the net and made it 1-1. One, one. Not what we need. Not what we need, but we can pick ourselves up. We can do it. I know we can. Mayo, then, with the goal kick, feeds it into Kanida. Burt was on this right-hand side. Norquette's coming to win it. Feeds it into Burt Whistle. We've got players offside. Stay onside, lads. Just stay onside and let it work for you. Kanida then into Waters and Guipasi. Space on the left-hand side if we can use it. We do into a bang. A 
bang, he's not been the sort of player I was expecting to be. Morton turns it to Waters. We're being cut off at every opportunity at the moment. We're having to play it across the lines, play it across the box. A bang with a shot from range, forcing a good save out of the goalkeeper. It had to take something like that to, to galvanise us to have a shot. Seddon then with a corner. Puts it in. Canido was underneath it. And Guipas, he heads it towards goal. Couldn't get enough direction on it. Goes past the post. Out for a goal kick. This is a good game. Match that saying it's a good game as well. It doesn't look like it from the amount of shots. But it is. <clears throat> it's there. The game is here. It's it, 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 it's, it's going to be a good one. We just need to make sure we are on the right end of it. We have a free kick here. Can we get this one in the back of the net? Can we get it onto someone's head? It is Seddon taking it. Oh, he hits the upright. Oh, what a shot that was. We saw the highlight just then. I thought we were going to get an attack on the go from that. Unlucky. He had power, precision on it. Just He couldn't get the right direction. Couldn't get the right spot within the goal. We are coming up to half time now. Half time whistle goes 1 1. 45 minutes to get ourselves into the final again for the second season. We do need to make a couple of changes though. Um, Seb Palmer Holden's going to come on for Armand Robertson because he's on a fitness test. And I think that's all we can do for now. Go with this. Fingers crossed. We can get ourselves a winner. I'm going to go on the attack. And I'm going to encourage. That's I think that's the right thing to do. We need to attack this game. We need to get into the final. Our players are doing okay fitness-wise. Match stats-wise. Beng's having a poor game. So he's probably going to be the next player that does come off. I don't want to encourage again. <clears throat> Let's make the change now then. 69 minutes on the clock. Burt Whistle's looking tired. Koachi's probably the only player that can come on and play. Actually, Ameson can. Ameson comes on. Swaps with Nguipasi. And Griffiths can come on for a bang. We'll do this. I know we've made all of our substitutions now. So if we end up in the... I think it's extra time at this level. I can't actually remember from the Torquay game last year. I think it is extra time. We probably can make one then. But we, I want us to... I want us to win it now. Let's go on the attack. Very attacking. Let's encourage. Come on, Weston. Come on, the mayor. Come on, boys. Three minutes of time added on. We've got a highlight here and a free kick. Ameson into Seddon. Back to Ameson. Gives it to Kanida. Don't give it away. Norquette turns the ball to Nguipasi on this right-hand side. He puts it in. I thought it fell to Seb Palmer holding, but it doesn't. Waters picks up the cleared ball. Morton turns. He's got players all around him. There's not a lot of space for us at the moment. Nguipasi feeds it into Nelson. Puts it across to Griffiths. He's hit the defender. We have a corner. Griff is going to put it to him. Put it on Kanida's head. It doesn't. It's cleared. Out for throwing for us. Nothing's going to happen. Highlight ends. Extra time. Oh, what do we say? I know we got it in us to win it. I know we do. I'm going to stay very attacking. We are in the ascendancy at the moment. We've got some tired players on the pitch, though. Let's, oh, let's make that final change now. Who is the most tired player on the pitch? It's Norkep. I need him. Uh, Kowachi's going to have to come on for Seddon. This, that's it. That's what we can throw it in, eh? We've thrown everything at this game. Half time. Go out there and do it, boys. Let's encourage again. Throw in for us then. Kowachi, left hand side. Gives it to Morton. Gives it back to him. Griffiths turns it into the box. Nilkets had to come out of the box. And Guipasi, don't shoot. Or do shoot. What a goal that was. I never had any doubt in him whatsoever. I didn't tell him to not shoot. And Guipis, he puts us 2-1 up in extra time. This drop down a positive. Ameson puts it in. And he's... Ignore the pun. He was aiming for Seb uh, Palmer Holden. Feeds it to Griffiths. Puts it in. We still got it. Griffiths again on right on the byline. To Morton. Nelson. Oh, hits the post. Hits the post. Um, have we got, what have we got here? We got nothing. We have nothing there. We're just waiting for the time to end here. Five minutes left to go. Are we in the final? It's a corner for Weldstone. Get it clear. Can he... Oh, he's giving away a penalty. Oh, no. Oh, Mayo, you absolute hero. 
Bradley Mayo has just saved the penalty. Kawa oh, we've got a player sent off. Oh no, so it's just a yellow. Just a yellow. Players on the floor scrabbling around. Dancing around a little bit there. They've got a free kick here in the final minute of time, of extra time. Is there another twist? Is there another sting in this tail? Mayo make, makes up a hero again. Oh, it deflects off the crossbar. We got a goal kick. Are we in the final? Oh, it took extra time and a wonder goal for Nguipasi, but we are in the final. One more game, two down, one to go. Is Weston getting promoted? Fingers crossed we are. Vanarama South playoff final, second year in the row. Can we go one better this year? Can we get promotion? We are playing another beach team. We're playing Weymouth at Weymouth. We can do this. The team we're putting out there then is Mayo in goal. A back four, Seddon and Guipasi, Ameson and Burt Whistle. Waters at the basement field with Morton and Nelson in front of him. A bang in the shadow striker role. Robinson and Norquette leading the line. Possibly for the final time for us this season. Norquette going back to Wrexham. I think that's where we got him on loan from. Yeah, it was Wrexham. We did get him there because he set that target in. He like, didn't hit. But we can do this. We've, we've, we've done our best to G the boys up, to give them everything they need to get us out of this division. We beat Weymouth 1-0 when we last played them. We can do it again. Come on, the mayor. We, we just need this. It's been four long seasons down here in the Vanarama South. We just need to get out of here. Need to get out of here. We can't keep bottling everything all the time. And it's a, it's a highlight for Weymouth, the first one. Mayo, oh, if we gave it away, he has. Oh, luckily he hasn't come back to haunt us. They put it over the bar. Mayo just causing himself an issue then. Punches the ball over the bar. Gives them a corner. We need to get this clear and get on the counter-attack. Just need to be a, a more alert to everything. We got they have got this ball clear. Morton chases it down. Just get it and run. Run, run, run. Now he's been pulled back. Oh, I, was, I was expecting a red card there. But yeah, maybe I was a little bit optimistic for it with it there. We need to be a bit, a bit more lively. 25 minutes. We haven't been there so far. XG of 0.01 so far, so we do need to encourage them. Seddon with a throw in, gives it to Morton, back to Seddon. Uh, Waters is giving it into Morton. Waters, have a shot. Oh, we do! Oh, it's Manny Norquette with the goal! We've offered absolutely nothing in this game, and we're in the lead. 1 0, half an hour gone, our first shot on target, or well, second shot on target now. Oh, brilliant stuff. Absolutely brilliant. It's what we need. What we needed, what we, we we were looking for, and hopefully this is going to settle whatever nerves we've got. As Weymouth come down the left-hand side, our, our defender was absolutely nowhere then. And May, well, Mayo's made a very good save there. Comes off his chest, goes out for a throw-in. If we can get ourselves into half-time, 1-0 up, we can just tell the boys to, 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 to settle, really. Half-time whistle is about to go as this corner comes in from Weymouth. It's one of those uh, short corners. Hopefully, oh, lucky it does go wide, as I was saying. Hopefully, it's not going to trouble us whatsoever. There goes the halftime whistle. 1 0 to Weston at the moment. We have one foot in the Vanarama National. Let's say that to the boys. Who's looking tired? Who needs to come off? I know no one wants to come off. And it is going to be no one that comes off at the moment. Going to keep it like this for another 15, 20 minutes or so. Going to stick on the, or stay with the positive mentality, and I'm also going to say no pressure to the boys. They worked against, uh, who was it we played? Wellin. Worked against Wellin. Hopefully it's going to work here against Weymouth. We're coming up to when I said we're going to make the substitutions. 66, we'll make it after this highlight here. It is Weymouth with the ball. They put it forward. Oh no. 1-1, one, one, 67 minutes on the clock. We need to, we need to come alive. We need to find another goal. Seddon's going to come off. Narty's going to come on for him. And the other change we're going to make is in the midfield. It's going to be Zach Nelson coming off and Jack Griffiths coming on for him. Two changes there. We are going to attack the game. We're now going to encourage him. We need to get the ball up to Norquette. We need to get him on the score sheet again. Come on, we can do it. A Beng's going to have to come off as well because he's having a torrid game. Let's go. Who have we got to come on for him? 
I'm going to go with this. We're going to change the formation slightly. We're going to put Robinson in there. We're going to play with two target men. He's going to go on support. Hopefully, with the three up front, we can find a goal. Walters puts this one in. Trying to find Ameson. He does. No care. Oh, he hits the post. No, he didn't hit the defender. I thought he hit the post. We got a corner. Can we get it? Narty was going to put it in. Find a Western head. Find a Western player and put it in the back of the net. Don't waste any more time. Go on, just put it in. Put it in. There we go. Oh, couldn't beat the first man. Morton picks it up and the highlight ends. Come on, boys. Four minutes. Go very attack him. Got a minute left. Extra time again. Let's say that to the boys. Got 15 minutes to find a goal. Let's encourage them. Let's just, just, yeah, just encourage them. It's all we can do. Gonna have to make another change. Make it after this free kick. It is. Who's on free kick duties now? It's Waters. Puts it in! Eamon Waters has just put us in the lead. Oh, it's exactly the same as the Wildstone game. Weymouth 1, Western 2. We've got. Just over 15 minutes to, to hang on. Hang on and then we secure a promotion. Big goal kick then from Weymouth. We need to win this ball. We're still on the very attack and we need to come off this. We need to get positive. Narty's chasing the ball down. They putting it forward. And Guipissi clears it. Oh, we've headed it on. Can Robinson find it? He can. Palmer Holden's picked up the loose ball once again though. Gives it back to Nguipissi. Plays it forward. Our player was offside this way. He didn't go for it. Palmer Holden then. Hugs the line. Narty. Morton has a shot. Oh. Hits the top of the net. Hits the top of the net. We need to get this corner clear. Oh, we don't. Oh, it's 2 2. Again, we need to go very attack him. Very attack and encourage. 10 minutes to go. Gonna make a final change here. Uh, it's gonna be. Uh, we need a left back, don't we? So, right back. Koachi's going to come on. We've thrown everything we can at this game. Absolutely everything. There we go. Just one more encouragement. One minute of time added on before we go to penalties. And it is penalties. Oh, I never know what to say with these. I never know what to say with these team talks. But here we go. We're taking the first one. It is going to be Norket. 2 2. The game finished. Penalties then. Norket. Absolutely dreadful penalty. Mr. Mayo needs to make a save. And he doesn't. Oh, all the pressure is on us now. All the pressure on Western Supermare. Palmer Holden. Oh, he's got that back. Come on. Mayo needs to make a save. You need to save this one. Ah, oh, he went the right way as well. 2-1. Morton steps up. Left foot. Ah, oh, yes. Back level. Pressure on Mayo. Just needs to save two. Save two and we score them. That's all we need. That's top corner. He wasn't saving that one. There's no way in hell we were saving that one. Water steps up. Can he keep it alive? Gone. He does. Bottom corner right. Goalkeeper went the wrong way. Given the eyes. Come on, Mayo. You saved one against Weldstone. Save one in the penalty shootout now. Nah, it goes the wrong way. Pressure's on us to score here. Pressure's on us to score, and then pressure's on Mayo to save. It's in Guipussi. Been here since I've been here as well. He steps up, shoots, and he does score. 4-4. Four, four. Mayo, make the save. Make the save. And then make the save again. That's all we want. Make the save, score, make the save. No, it goes the wrong way. We lose in the final again. We can't get out of this division. I can't win a playoff. I don't know what to do. I really don't. I'm 
Because when, when does my contract run out? 2028. Another year. Can I do another year down here in Western now? Because I feel like all we're doing is... We're doing the same thing over and over and over again. We're, we're, we're bottling things. What's the jobs like out there? There's a lot out there. A lot of jobs that take a punt on me, I bet. we got a decision to make. If you guys have enjoyed that, big thumbs up on the video for me. Subscribe to the channel as well if you haven't really done so. And as always, folks, thank you very much for watching.